every other fucking faction that I've needed to join has been so pathetically easy. This sounds like an absolute nightmare. How am I gonna do any of this? Also, what is this? That leads to Huxy. Whatever the fuck that is, let's have a little look at the world map. Oh, okay. This is the sheet. The sheet is just a place. And it's right next to Issa, which looks like a massive fucking greenhouse, and I'm absolutely there for that. Looks, that looks amazing. Uh, I think I'm gonna teleport out of here, though. As much as I'm really enjoying this area, I don't really want to go much deeper into the world map, because we have gone a long fucking way in a very, very short amount of time so far, and I feel like I've missed so very much. Uh, back to the local map. Oh. Oh, I can steal whatever the fuck I want from here. Three lamps in? Who am I stealing from, though? I know it said one was sta staying in Dydenbrick or whatever the fuck. But come on, man! All these people are dying! Do I really need to steal from this guy of all people? Stupid bloody peasants! Alfred Grillrigas will not suffer to get this sickness afflicting this town. Now be gone. Take your poison there and get out of my sight. It's bad enough that I'll be quarantined here. I'm like literally the only healthy man in the entire fucking place. What are you talking about? I'd say Ilfic will not even have it on him? Was that what it said? Some shitty tattered documents. Oh yeah, it was like, ah, oh, he will not do it while you are in his sight, or whatever the fuck. Are you- are you leaving this place? Oh, I hate you! Surely this can't be a failable quest. I really don't want to be kicked out of the Travelers forever just because this guy's an asshole, and I thought I'd be able to talk to him first. Where did you go? Who's this? Oh, this is him? Okay. Why can I pickpocket you? I don't want your pathetic amount of- You are a war hero! Everyone loves you! And you have six dollars to your name! This is so depre- Yes, dollars is the currency of the world of Amalur, of course it is, but still. I just want to talk to you. But I know I've already- Oh yeah, that's right, okay, so we need to wait for a moment where I just stand still like a fucking moron. Is it gonna matter if a god sees me stealing, or is it only him? Anyone who is able serves in the militia. It's the only uh, it doesn't matter. But his medallion is hanging out there. Oh, come on, come on, come on! Why is there no long grass? Why can't it be like any other video game of all fucking time? Not that the long grass thing ever makes sense, but at least it's fucking easy. Come on! Oh, now I'm being hunted by a fucking guard the entire time anyway. Don't worry guys, it's just how I walk, okay? Got a very, very bad back. 43! Fuck! God, I was so close! Come on, come on, come on. Come on, we're far away from the guard. He still hasn't noticed my presence somehow. This guy is so very stupid. I'd love your coins, but I'm only taking this. Could go for the rivets. I don't want the rivets, right? Okay, back off, back off, back off, back off, back off. Ah! He immediately checked? He felt me just smack his fucking ass on the way past? Well, uh, maybe we can Get take that one a little bit further. Mutants. I'm Alfwig Grillrakas. I don't need to put up with the likes of you. I am fully aware of who you are, sir. You did just mention that like three times before, and now I'm never talking to you again. Turn to Astrid Frisk. Alright, fine. Whatever. That was way easier than I expected it to be. I just wish I- <laughs> Oh, God. I just wish I could have learned a little bit about my victim there. Make sure that I was actually doing the right thing. He seemed to be an absolute arsehole, but that doesn't 100% make him an absolute arsehole, right? Alright, Astrid. I got- I mean, he let me slap his ass without any real repercussions. I think he was into it. Oh, Maybe he just likes berating his lovers. At least... at least you have the plague shield. It will last for a while yet, at any rate. Thank you. Thank you and bless you so very, very much. If you have she just hands, looks like, like she's back. picking her nose really aggressively. That did not- I know it's meant to be coughing, but that did not look like coughing at all. Uh, who the fuck is Luminitsa? Well, she made no friends when she first settled here. Don't know which had less sense in their noggins. Her or the craft a lot. You hate the and crafters what like too? To what, because they unionized? Why see it coming? Because she's a witch, not an absolute god. Or maybe it's all happening because of me. Maybe the Fateless One showing up has set all these horrific events in motion because the world doesn't know what to do and it's punishing us. I don't know, that all came out of- that was just a- <laughs> so much shit that I pulled out of my ass. Shit that I- I could have phrased that a lot better. But it's, uh, yeah, I- 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 <laughs> Give me a second, 
brain completely malfunctioning. Let me take a big old sippy. Yeah, it was just shit I made up on the spot. There we go. That's 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 a much better way of putting that. Um, but I don't know. It sounds like it could be true. But then again, anything that sounds like it could be true in this terrifying fucking world that we've been thrown into. So, tell me more about oh, Fallon. Dear. That is an old stone. These days, it's almost common to lose a friend. And I'll tell you, he was a dear one. Is that why your face hasn't fucking moved in the goddamn mission. slightest the entire time? Sorrow keeping. Sometimes this game is actually pretty damn good at showing emotion and everything, but not, not here. I have no well, diseases. Okay, that's a good you. sign. And for once, I have no active quest. I mean, I have a billion that I could use, but I'm not using them just yet. I might just get persuasion up again, because it looks like we've hit the lovely, lovely, lovely level eight at last. How high can I go? Yeah, I've hit persuasion. Not persuasion. Sorry, I've hit that. I have that. Hit yet another milestone. I cannot speak English. What the fuck's wrong with me? Sorcery. Let's bring that up to. I want Frost Shackle. Frost Shackle looks so cool. So does Chain Lightning. But I guess I want a God Tier Summon first. I could get him to max level here, right? Or at least very close to it. Ooh. And the buffs just start getting absolutely insane. Now he's about to have double the damage he fucking set out with. And that is very, very, very cool. And then after that, I think I'm gonna get Healing Surge. I don't know if I want that to be max or whatever the fuck. Ooh. Wait, what? You have to sustain it. So I guess it's just rapid regeneration. It's not like a single fucking heal. It's like a perma fucking heal. And that's very, very weird. Alright, we haven't quite made it to sorcery level 28 yet. Do I want to be like a magical thief boy? I mean, I really, really, really want to advance in the traveler's path. But at the same time, like, it's gonna make my summoning, it's gonna make my magic in general so much weaker. I love everything about it, but am I really gonna start using daggers? I don't think I am, not permanently. Maybe to get a couple of shanks here and there, but other than that, no, it's it's not worth it. As much as I absolutely love being a rogue, and clearly have an addiction to being a rogue, because I'm getting withdrawal symptoms, <laughs> I just need to go back to playing a rogue fucking immediately. But no, I'm really, really enjoying the sorcery lifestyle. It's very, very fun. And I actually think I'm, I'm probably having a hell of a lot more fun with this than I would as a rogue in this game, purely because the spells are just so fucking cool. I have no idea. Let me quickly have a look at some of those finesse abilities. Execution. Okay, these are pretty cool. And I guarantee you they're at least way cooler than might. What's this? Assassin's art? They just sound awesome. God damn, dude. Enduring agate? They've got a lot of passive attacks, I've noticed. Arrow storm. They got all this shit that is exclusive to daggers. All this shit that's exclusive to longbows. Yeah, I like... I like a lot. Shadow magic. So they are natural sorcerers as well. What the fuck? We were never told that. That's amazing. Other reagents from that. Uh... Fine. When is this mission ever going to end? How much do you need, sir? You are insatiable. If you're buying goods in Dydenhill, it's Cora Bannock you want. Your bloodlust can never be satiated, can it, my friend? Yep, there we go. Oh, oh, more, more reagents. Oh, I don't, I don't have any more. Do we ever run out? I, I, I don't understand. Does, does this quest ever start? I fucking hate repeating quests. They're the most annoying things in the world because I kind of just want them to get the fuck out of my quest log. But apparently, that's not allowed in the fucking slightest. I have to accept you here for all time. You are now my lifelong best friend and I get no choice in the matter. Mm. Where's Etron? Etron is nowhere to be seen. So I think I'm gonna go to the Coils Bane Caverns. Or maybe, no, I'm gonna go back up to Hunter's Pit. Cause I never really had a chance to explore around there. Hunter's Pit West is the only one we actually went to. <coughs> so I don't really know why the vast majority of the, what the fuck, this is still here? Huh, I didn't expect that to be a thing. I kind of expected those to disappear as soon as we left the area. I also expected the bears to respawn. It's not like there's a finite number of enemies on this map. Though I've always wondered, what, like, an open world, this is completely out of nowhere because this game is nothing like that. But, like, an open world zombie game, let's say, 
the best fucking idea, the, the first thing that comes to mind is like a State of Decay kind of game. The original State of Decay, I never played the sequel, although I've heard it's pretty good, but not really as good as the first. A game like that, like a zombie apocalypse that sort of ramps up and ramps up and ramps up, but there is like an actual finite number of zombies. It probably wouldn't work, it would probably get boring once you're just hunting down like the last few hundred zombies, and you have no idea where they are in this big ass open world. But I just think it's something really, really interesting that I don't think many devs at the very least, if any devs ever, have ever really looked into. Probably for a reason. It's probably just a terrible idea. But I've always kind of wondered ever since I played games like that. Did I get the other one? I absolutely did get the other one. Fucking hell, we are just too good. I need the chakrams. I never really get a chance to, and I want to see what my summoner can do now. Are you alright? Are you actually fucking decent? You are not hitting. You are missing with every single shot you try to do. I hate slow boy weapons. God damn. Well, that leads up there. How the hell would I get up there? I want to explore everything, game. Come on, let me. Can I pickpocket a brownie? I highly doubt brownies have anything worthwhile. What's oh my god, you're so horrible. You sort of look like a very, very ancient, creepy old lady's face. Just sh what? Well, I was about to say shrunken down. The complete fucking opposite. Absolutely enlarged beyond belief. And then shoved on the head of this little dwarf creature. It's, just, it's the worst thing I've ever seen. I hate the family so much. There we go. Ah, uh, me and my fleshless buddy here. Isn't it so damn sweet? I really like this guy. I don't know why, I, I, he's not really accomplishing a whole lot. He kind of just, you know, sits there and takes a beating. Very rarely actually lands a hit, but he's, he's just nice to have with me. This is kind of a very, very lonely world without companions. I'm surprised this game hasn't given me a companion yet, considering how we, we've done, like, two main missions. What am I talking about? Oh yeah, I'm meant to be going to jail. I kind of completely forgot about that. Huh. Oops. Now, what's the, uh, what's the gods here overly powerful attack with these things? Oh. Okay, just swing them around a little bit. That is kind of boring, but I'll take it anyway. And I look forward to selling these. What are you? Oh, nice! So much borderline decent weapons that I'll never use. But the random poor general store lady who I keep driving out of business absolutely will, because she has to. Because coding. Uh, I want to go to Webwood as well. There's so many places I want to go to, man. What are you? Arden's Hut. This is Dyden Hill. That's Ironhold Passage. I think I used Ironhold Passage uh, in Webwood to get here. For some reason, I can... Okay, I need to reach Ballard's Oratory on foot before I can fast travel there. Fuck me, this world is so big. Could go to Lorca Rain. Could also absolutely not do that and do something worthwhile, like... Acquiring the last dagger. I didn't realize that was right here. Fuck yeah. Let's go back on the local map though, because it seems to be telling me. Yeah, that's Coil's Bane. Coil's Bane. Coil's Bane? I can't fucking read what is wrong with me. God damn. Sorry, I woke up like really late today. Um, because I spent. <laughs> as of recording, it's like the 18th of. Uh, oh god, what month is it? September, right now. And, um. Pre orders for the PS5 went online last night. And I was up at like 6 a.m. still. Desperately trying to fight a constantly fucking crashing website to make sure I could pre-order on time because there's I know there's massive shortages and I know I'm probably overreacting but I was like I desperately want one on launch and it's like this is the first because I'm a young boy I'm not like I, I, I am an adult but I am a young young boy and uh, this is like the first console I've ever been able to buy for myself on launch and I'm really fucking happy about that I think it's so fucking cool. Um, and it just, it felt really, really nice to be able to buy it just straight up. So, uh, yeah, I was desperate to do that last night. And oh my god, these are the Jotun. Oh yeah, never mind. I was terrified by those flowers for a minute. And then I remember they sort of showed up like right at the start of the game. And it just means that I am a very, very magical man. As we can obviously tell. Nothing is more magical than my delicious touch. My dulcet tones. It says kill 10. Also, why did the Bogarts need to place this big anyway? I don't think the Jotuns would have driven you out. They probably wouldn't have even noticed your presence. Look at the fucking size of them. Also, when we told the Arf... Arain? Arfain? Afarain? 
what whatever the fuck that um the race is that I can never remember Alphane or something like that. Um when we told that Alphane could grow to be as big as Jotun, because I'm starting to doubt that very much. That sounds like the most terrifying thing I can even fucking imagine. Look how huge these dudes are! And one's running away? Why? You are clearly so much more powerful than me. Get the fuck out of here, you nearly insta-killed my new friend! Oh my god! I can't believe I can sort of keep you back. Like, it's very hard to make you flinch. I can't make you flinch when you're charging me. By the way, that was the most pathetic charge I've ever seen. But shit! <laughs> you didn't do very much damage. Okay, you're like trolls, but unbelievably pathetic. This is fine. Though you're also clearly civilized, because you can build yourself some nice pretty belts and actual fucking breastplates. You are sentient. You have civilization. And I'm just running into your lovely little home and genociding. This isn't okay. Why am I doing this to these poor fucking giants? They're not as badass as, like, the Norse giant equivalents I expected them to be. Uh... But they're still people, kinda, sorta, right? Is this their stuff? If it's their stuff, it's not gonna fit me. I don't know why I'm even trying. I'm absolutely gonna steal everything you've ever fucking loved, including your own lives. It's a big-ass fucking dungeon, huh? I'm surprised no Warsworn have come with me. I would very much appreciate that. I can't do all this shit on my own, can I? Well, of course I can. I'm a fucking protagonist. I can always do shit on my own. You stayed behind. That doesn't seem very clever. My dude, what the fuck are you doing? I don't care because you gave me the fangs of... <laughs> There's no way I'm ever going to figure out how to pronounce that. But you look amazing. Discovered, long lost, and broken. In a midden deep in... <laughs> These daggers were reforged, restored, and enchanted to order by a Tuatha assassin. And a boggart bit off his face and stole them? How? How did a boggart defeat a fucking Tuatha assassin who was clearly good enough to be worthy of that? That's some pretty cool shit, you know. Come on. Out there? Yeah. Oh, God. Ah! Oh, come on! It looks like it's slowing down there. You cannot tell me I'm wrong. I don't understand. I wasted two lockpicks on an easy chest. I am unbelievably ashamed right now. God damn. I don't deserve to be the protagonist in this story. You wanna take over, Skelly Boy? Ske Skelly Boy disintegrated. You wanna take over now, Skelly Boy? Skelly Boy! Where you at? There he is, okay. Just took a few tries. I guess maybe he didn't disintegrate. He was just very, very interested in that one cave wall. And I can't deny you, rocks are fucking badass. But I mean, there's a lot more badassery going on around here, my friend, and it's mostly me. Alright, what do we got here? A lovely little bit of cripple. Me jamming all those cripples in my pockets very soon. I just wish I knew what they could do. The Quirass of Shattering. Longbow of Leeching and a Warrior's Staff. Let's have a little look. I could always use a new stuff. Fucking hell, the flame is just amazing. Nothing ever beats it, I don't understand. What about armor? Leather, I knew it would be finesse. You're gonna be finesse. Oh, you're might, okay. A mighty Quiros? Really? That surprises me. Quiros is always like the light armor in video games, isn't it? And yeah, it, I, I can never, ever, ever get used to basically saying queer ass every time I try and say that word. But I, I promise you, that is how it's pronounced. For years, when I was when I was younger, I, I didn't quite I didn't quite look at the spelling right for years, and in my head it was always curious or something like that. It's not. It's not even close to that. It is just straight up queer us because medieval times are stupid. All right, what have we got here? Soldier's Helm. You're green, so you're probably worth money. What have we got over here? Man, we've gone a long fucking way without fighting Jotun. In fact, there are more Bogarts in here than Jotun. I'm surprised that they didn't clear the Jotun out themselves. Wow. What the fuck is this? The sky never looks like this when I'm actually outside in the open world. So why the fuck are you all purple and terrifying and the world is about to die when I'm just hanging out in this cave? Maybe the Jotun... I don't know. I've got no explanation for this. So we're just going to ignore it and pretend it never happened. Do you think I can backstab a Jotun until he dies immediately? Yeah, I didn't think so. Let's, uh, let's straight up end this bitch, shall we? 
<laughs> oh my god, that's so overpowered. Immediately do it again as well. That is two accidental jihads in a row. How are you still alive? Go away! Uh oh! Move! Oh, okay, so that is the issue with the shark rubs. I thought they were just straight up better than any other weapon I tried for a while, but you just can't dodge if you're in the middle of one of its extra long animations. And while they do attack very, very fast, don't get me wrong. What do you mean three out of ten? Those was one of these just not a Kyoten? Just a very, very large la I'm pretty sure it was a fucking Kyoten. You been okay, there we go. The quest just has to update in a very, very slow order. Ugh. But yeah, um, what the fuck was I talking about? Yeah, that long ass animation, which only seems to be a problem on that one last one. It's this one here, where you just can't jump until they fucking come back. What? Now I can! Maybe it's because we're out of combat, and it just, like, really gives the enemies the advantage in combat, because it knows this game is so fucking easy otherwise. Free lockpick and a load of shards that mean nothing to me. Thank you very much, large boy. I will be seeing you, well, never again, probably. Bye. Hmm. I seem to remember them saying that there was a city of the Yotun, or at least a village or a town, or just some kind of settlement. I remember that being mentioned. So, I'm hoping they're ones I can actually talk to? Because I think they're so cool, man. Oh, they've already seen me. How have they already seen me? If you've already seen me, why aren't you coming to murder me? I'm just slamming the floor for no reason. It was the only one who hadn't seen me at that point. All right, whatever. Get tased. Oh, yeah, you're weak to that shit. It stuns, doesn't it? I forgot about that. Come on, I gotta get both in one. How did that only hit that guy? Come on. I mean, that guy's arguably already suffered enough, but who the hell cares? Bye-bye. He stood up. Or he stayed up, I mean. Get the fuck out of here, Chieftain. He can barely even be stunned. I do not like that guy. I do not like that guy at all. So I'm going to blast you instantly, bye! Bye! <laughs> oh my god, that was horrible! At least he only does about the same amount of damage as pathetic little warriors. Oh my god, he's all alone! That's not okay! He's actually doing a really good job! I didn't expect that, he's doing a better job than I am! I mean, I'm against two, but still! Bye bye! <laughs> You're still alive- You're not allowed to still be alive! Oh, he slammed his head against yet another one of his fucking hammers. <laughs> Mm. Fine cotton cow, which is going to be shit. Why am I even bothering? It's extra shit. It's even shittier than I expected it to be. And that was the chieftain. That is what the god of all of them decided to drop. What did you even have that for? Is it large enough to fit you? In which case, it's armor's gonna be off the fucking charts, but it isn't. Huh. Alright, well, I mean, this is the chieftain's area, so it better have the best loot, right? Just a fuckload of potions! Yay, I guess. Uh, blasting daggers? I'll, I'll definitely take a look. Slashing fury! And a fuckload of lockpicks. Alright, the game's being nice to me again. I'm actually finding loot that I care about. I mean, not the daggers. Pretty much purely the lockpicks. But still, it's something, right? I really need to get that finding hidden objects or hidden parts thing as well. Because I'm getting very, 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 very nervous that I keep leaving behind, like, obvious chunks of rock that can be smashed open or something. Not that we've really seen destructible walls or anything like that, or just illusionary walls you can walk right through. But it's gotta be something that exists, right? Otherwise, why would that ability be a thing? Hell, maybe you can only find them if you have really good detected. So maybe that's what I should focus. I don't know. I'm not taking you. You sound too boring to ever sell for any decent money. A steel greatsword, like the other millions and millions and millions of steel greatswords that existed. Yeah, good for you, aren't you? So very unique. How long do you last? Doesn't even really feel like five minutes. Is it maybe two or three? Because that that sucks. I want more. Where the fuck are those last two Jotun? Two hidden boys, huh? The hell have I left behind? Two keys. Or maybe one key that opens both locks, but still a fucking key. Huh. There's no way I missed out on this, right? You just want me to come back later? I'm not coming back later. I want to finish this now! Well, I'm in the mood for fighting fucking sentient meatballs. What's this? That's the fucking greatsword. Fuck off. If it's gonna be anywhere, it's gonna be on the fucking Chieftain's corpse. Surely, right? Or at least something that the Chieftain held very, very dear to him. 
But no, I, I see nothing. Which one was the chieftain? I can't really tell. Is that- oh, it's definitely the dude with the cool helmet. Fuck me. Aw, they died in each other's arms. And that guy sort of awkwardly trying to force himself onto the other one's face. But we're just- we're, we're not gonna question that. It's, it's just- it's- it's the Jotun way, okay? I mean, I've been in this chest. I can't go up there. It would show on the map if I could. Could I dive into their water supply? I don't really want to be drank by any of these dudes if I die, so no thanks. Ah. All I can see is this potentially being a little way in. But no, it is just another- it leads to another rock! I hate you. I hate you and everything you stand for. Maybe I can knock down that fucking ladder or anything. No? This might call for our first out of the fucking- Oh, it caved in. Oh no. Oh, it's either find that key or I am literally stranded here forever. You are mean, game. Can I walk up here? It so looks like I should be able to walk up there. I mean, it's then immediately blocked by fuckloads of rocks again, but come on. A whole extra two feet? There's a lot a man can do with a whole extra two feet. That would have been funnier if I had said inches, and now I am ashamed of myself. Right, where the hell are we going? Can I climb that? I know there's nothing in that particular chest, so it's got to be closer to where we actually end up. It's got to be in here. Because <laughs> there is right now literally no way out of this hellhole. Maybe I can get behind here. Maybe I can walk right through. No, you exist for no- you're just a big wheel. I, I don't actually know what you are. I thought you were sort of like a- what would you call that? You know those vault doors that then sort of like twist and come away and they're, they're sort of like circular? I thought it was something like that and it was like covering up a pipe in there or a tunnel in there or something, but no. No. Can I just break it down? It doesn't look too hard. What? Oh, you can only open the fucking ruins with the correct key. What the fuck are you talking about? It was straight up lying to me the entire time? I either did unlock it and it told me that I didn't, or you just did not need a key. And I don't remember picking up a key, so I, I think the game was straight up fucking lying to me like a bitch. Wow. That looked way fucking cooler than I expected. God damn. I definitely need a friend. If he's on his own, it's gotta be some special type boy, right? No, you're just another warrior. Dude, I killed your chieftain. Wait, you have no fucking business here. Go away. I wanna see how much damage my new boy can do. But he never actually seems to hit unless that 55 was him. Actually, I think that 55 wasn't. No, it's me. I just do double, don't I? Fuck's sake. Come on, come on, come on, big one! That does nothing. I guess it's just AoE. But it, it barely does enough damage to warrant not just slapping me, because my regular attacks can be AoE. More like a cone than a big fucking radius, but it, it's something. Oh god, okay, I do not want to be in that position. That is something I never, ever, ever want to see again in my entire life. And now you're frozen like that forever, because for some reason that's how the game works. So, uh, enjoy your post-death pole dance routine, and I'll be on my way. Pole dancing without the poles, it's very impressive. What exactly are you? Can I summon the last two by standing here? <laughs> no, and I can't really command my little idiot to do so either. What the fuck are you? You look like the Hierophant more than anything else, and those are jellyfish. I have no idea where I've ended up, but I fucking love it. I feel like there's a hell of a lot more to this than just a bogart domain nest, whatever the hell you want to call it. What the fuck? The rest of this place is underwater. Dude, this is amazing! <laughs> My jaw is like, it, it, it would be dropping if I wasn't smiling so fucking much. What a badass area. Why is it pouring in through there? Is it like glass keeping it out or is it some kind of magical force that's waning a little bit and that's why we've sprung a fucking leak? I don't know, but that is one of the- Oh my god, I have found Atlantis. And the game doesn't even seem to give a fuck. Is this like a- a, a Hyotun palace? Is this where they live in the world? Because, I mean, Yotun, in actual mythology, if memory serves, which it should, because I am... A, a lot of my descendants from, like, Norwegian, and I am very much into Viking culture. No, summon. He was literally right that We watched him die. You don't need to despawn him first. 
Uh, yeah, they, they were like the ice giants, pretty much. Most of them, they, they descend from the ice giants and they live in like their big ice palaces in the sky and shit like that. This is like the complete opposite. This is underwater in case you hadn't fucking noticed, game. But, uh, wow. I love everything about it anyway. What? Oh, I thought you were stunned. I was going to take you out in one. Oh, well, whatever. I only got that one guy again as well. This sucks. I don't know why you wouldn't save the chieftain till last either. Especially when we've just fought our way through, what, like, nine of these warriors once we've taken- This guy's dead already. That wasn't even me. This is the guy I did most of the damage to. I think that must have been my little skelly bitch doing all that damage. The natural order, was this always what it was called? I think maybe the quest changed names once we discovered this place. Either way, I absolutely adore it. And I would love to be able to explore it more, but I have just noticed that that's like a 2D sprite of a tower. Or at least a 2D sprite texture plastered over what I think- I can't even tell if that is 3D. It is. It's just very, very weirdly done. I mean, the texture is not 3D, but what the fuck is that? Okay, that's kind of ruined the, be the, the beauty of this place just a little bit. But I understand why all the way back in 2012. Hi. Bite Logris. You surprised me. What are you doing down here? Killing all of your enormous lovers? Orders. But did Padaxes send you? Lysander, perhaps? Tell me. Those I just wanted to kill no some bugards. What, I'm capable what of, are you? Which is obvious if you're all they sent to stop me. I, I apologize. I'll leave you be. I wonder. You've seen what this place is, yes? An entire city constructed to focus the power of a single spell. You did I all this yourself? I already cast the spell. Even now, my deathless servants rise from centuries of slumber. No, it is clear I cannot let you live. But answer me this, and I'll grant you a swift death. Which one sent you? Was it Padaxis or Lysander? What are you talking about? Fine. Whether you're an agent of the Rose Court or the no, 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 no. Tower, what? You can take your secret to the okay, group. at least you gave me two I very blatant fucking factions I need to check out. Soon, both of their houses will crumble. You, however, will not live to see their ruin. But I want to say the other thing! And I will say the other thing, because it looks so much fucking cooler than the- Oh, what? How far back is this? It's like five minutes. What did I do in the last- Oh, I came back through here. All right, fine, fine, fine. I'll see you guys when we get back to there after doing the exact same fucking fight over and over and over. Oh boy.